Hello, my friends. This is Gamer1745 here with my new War Movie of the Week Club, in which we will look at one movie uh, a week. And I'll get into why this, is, why this is important at the end of the video. But before we get into this movie, just want to ask everyone if they wouldn't mind liking the video, subscribing to the channel, and you don't know how important it is to share this on any other platform and comment below. Love to hear your comments. What would be your ideas for a war movie of the week? That would be a good one. Right. Well, let's get into this movie. Sahara, 1943. That's um, the title is Sahara, but there's many movies with that title. But this is the one made in 1943, which is in, to define this one. Great movie. Everyone who's interested in World War II should see it, partially because it was made in 1943. It was part of the war, the propaganda efforts. And of course, Sarah Sahara here is um, starring Humphrey Bogart, um, which you may have not, may, have, may, I mean, this is partially why I'm making it. Everyone should have heard of him. Um, star of like Casablanca, The Maltese Falcon, and so many other movies. Right. He's starring in it. That's good enough reason. Um, another person who's just starting his career is Lloyd Bridges is in this movie as well. Um, again, Lloyd Bridges started in too many things to be named. Um, but one of them was Battlestar Galactica, the original series, and he is father of Jeff and Bo Bridges, um, actors still around. So, um, yeah, those are the two main people you may have heard of in the movie. So, um, definitely you should see about checking this movie out. Another movie poster from it, we can see this thing. Now, the basic story of it, and I won't give away the spoilers of it for those of you who have not seen it. It's a story of an isolated tank crew um, in the North African desert, set uh, like around 42. Um, fictionalized, very fictional, but um, so, and they're sort of um, attempts to get because they're isolated to get back to the, you know, their lines, friendly lines, and what goes on to deal with it. At one point, they capture a Luftwaffe pilot here. Um, we can see him there with some of the various men that, men that have joined Bogart. That's um, Bogart there, of course. And here, um, another shot of them in the desert. Bogart um, there behind a... Um, not a Maxim. No, 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 that is a Maxim, sorry. No, is that a Vickers or a Maxim? That, I believe, is a Maxim machine gun, not a Vickers. Maxim machine gun, yeah. Um, captured in the movie here. So, um, yeah. And another poster from the movie. That's it about the movie here, but I want you to go out and watch it. Now, why this is important? Well, of course, I want to give recommendations to good movies that if you're interested in this topic, um, I think you would enjoy watching. Culture. is partly a, sh um, a shared set of experiences, a shared um, mythology, a shared viewpoint. And we're losing a lot of this stuff. And I wanted to start out, and there's a lot of jokes about how old I am and whatnot compared to a lot of the viewers here. This truly is well before my time, but I knew about this growing up. Um, it just that I absorbed all of this stuff. And it seems not obscure things, but very common and big things. So many of the 30 and unders that watch the channel just haven't even heard of, let alone not seen and don't have reference to that. I just am amazed that you guys just don't know about it. Nah. 
you're missing out a lot. Not that you, there's a lot of stuff, a lot of bad stuff out there. You don't need to bother to watch. Not everything that happened before you is good, but just that you haven't um, experienced some of the basic cultural elements and um, just watching some video of Overlord DVD. Um, and that's partially what's inspiring it is he's looking at popular culture where this is sort of military history culture. And you need to have these frames of reference. And so that is why I want to make um, this weekly series. So um, everyone take the time. There's ways to do it for free. I'm not going to explain how. You know, go out in a boat somewhere. But um, it's available for rental uh, online in many um, sources, Sahara. Um, 1943, don't get it confused with the 2008 Jim Belushi remake or a bunch of other movies with the title of Sahara in them, um, but this is the Humphrey Bogart. Um, very good movie. Uh, I think this is really important that if you haven't watched it, you should. Um, please comment below. Tell me what you, once you've seen the movie or if you've already seen it before making this, tell me what you think about it. As like I said in the, the beginning, um, what other movies you think that are important for a movie of the week? Um, War movie of the week uh, movie, but don't make it anything in the last like five years. You know, nothing recent. We're, we're looking backwards and trying to do that. So thank you, everyone. See you next time.